I'm Paul Erlinson. I'm the director of product support for Link Studio Technology. Uh, we're here at the AES show in San Francisco. 08, uh, showing our wares. Uh, we come every year. Uh, we can't seem to get enough of this place. Um, today I'm going to talk a little bit about one of our newest products, which is the AS16E. This is a PCIe adaptation of our AS16 card. So as a general overview, it's 16 channels of AES EBU in and out. Uh, there's also a version of it that has sample rate conversion, 16 channels of very high quality 10 to 1 sample rate conversion on board. And yet a third variation includes AES50, which is a new multi-channel protocol similar to MADI, but with some uh, very interesting control possibilities and a very low jitter, long cable runs. So that's supported as well. Um, there's a few different ways to integrate PCIe. And so when we tackled this project, we decided to do it, take the high road, and we didn't use any sort of bridge technology. That'd be a way of adapting your card quickly and cheaply, but you don't really experience the, the benefits of the PCIe bus. So we, uh, we did it correctly in our view, and as a result, uh, there's a significant per performance enhancement uh, over the AS16. Namely, the PCIe bus is capable of simultaneous reads and writes. Uh, so by taking advantage of that, we can hit much lower latencies than we can with the regular PCI product. So as an example, uh, at 96 kilohertz, you can hit a round trip latency of about a millisecond and a half, which is uh, quite impressive for a product like that. So, um, so it works with uh, PCs on Windows, uh, including Vista, Vista 64, uh, XP, you know, all the usual suspects, ASIO drivers and WDM, uh, kernel streaming as well as direct SAM. On the Mac side, it works with both Mac Pros, Intel-based machines, it has universal binary drivers, as well as G5s with PCIe slots. Um, also, again, very, very low latency under core audio. It'll work with Logic, Digital Performer, Nuendo Cubase, um, Peak, you know, all of the usual suspects. So. Um, there's also hardware monitoring on the AS16E. We have enhanced our mixer. It now supports up to 10 channels per output. So you can monitor all 16 inputs through a pair of outputs. You can simply assign what sources you want. They can either be record sources or playback streams. It's one thing a little bit unique about our routing is that you can have multiple streams from a variety of sources feeding the same output. We also are somewhat unique in that you can assign input sources to multiple record devices. So for instance, if you have a single stereo source coming into the card, you can have that distributed to different applications or different tracks within the same application. So, so it's very easy to use. It's, it's very high performance. It's been popular to be paired with our Aurora converters. Since those use ASCBU as their uh, native digital format, an AS16E paired with an Aurora 16 is an ideal 16 channel analog solution, um, A to D and D to A. There's some control information that goes back and forth, so the Aurora can be controlled through the AS16E. There's a, a software mixer for the Aurora uh, where some of the controls can be implemented. Also, the firmware can be updated on the Aurora through the AS16E, so there's a very tight level of connectivity between them. Uh, we, we have cables available to connect them through D sub, so two cables carry 16 channels in both directions, which is very convenient. Um, so the AS16E has been shipping for half a year now. Uh, all versions are shipping except the AS50, which we anticipate to be shipping by the end of the year. Um, it's been very, very successful. You can put up to four cards in a single machine for up to a 64 channel solution. And it supports sample rates up to 192 kilohertz without losing any channel count. It does not scale. So that can be 64 channels at 192 kilohertz or all the way down to uh, 32 kilohertz per card. So uh, it's been very successful and we look forward to it continuing to be so. And uh, thank you for your time today.